Hey guys, this is Dr. Hub. In case you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe for updates. Now we are looking at the normal pattern. The normal pattern of the ECG in different leads. So the first one we look at is the AVR. So what is AVR? AVR is all deflections are negative. So negative, all deflections. Then AVL and AVF. So AVL and AVF is predominantly positive or it is biphasic. So it can be biphasic as well. Then comes the V1 and V2. V1 and V2, there is a no Q wave and large S wave. So large S wave occurs in which type? So large S wave, you can see it occurs in V1 and V2. Then comes the V3. V3 is where biphasic. So V3, what happens? It is biphasic. Then V4, V5, V6. V4, V5, V6, there is a small Q wave and a tall R wave. So tall R wave is seen in what case? It's seen in V4, V5 and V6 and there is a small q wave there's a small q wave so small q wave it indicates again the v4 v5 and v6 so it is accompanied by a small q wave and a tall r wave then moving on to the leads one two and three so lead one two and three there is all positive deflections and the largest is in lead two so there is positive deflections and the largest the largest will be in lead two to learn and grow daily like this, please do subscribe.